أقبلنا والشوق حدانا لزيارة بيت الرحمن لنحج البيت بإخلاص فالحج متم الأركان وأتينا الميقات نلبي للنسك زمان ومكان ونزور البيت نطوف به بقلوب قبل الأبدان وكها جر نسعى في الوادي ويحد المسعى الجبلان في التاسع نأتي عرفات وبقلب ندعو ولسان الله الرحمن الرحيم الحمد لله رب العالمين والصلاة والسلام على أشرف الأنبياء والمرسلين وعلى آله وصحبه أجمعين السلام عليكم ورحمة الله وبركاته لبيك اللهم لبيك لبيك لا شريك لك لبيك إن الحمد والنعمة لك والملك لا شريك لك Subhanallah, in our trip now, we honor, we need to honor and glorify Allah by his, na- by his attribute, Al-Wakil. Al-Wakil, the universal trustee, the disposer of affairs, the trustworthy, the advocate agent. How more advocate th- than who is better than the supreme trustee, the guardian? and the administrator of all our affairs. We need, during our trip, to put our trust fully in Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. Can you imagine when you have a case and you employ, you uh, put an advocate for your case, and you say, now I'm relaxed because I've uh, uh, signed up for advocate who will stand up for me. I don't need to do anything. This advocate now, is Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala, al-wakil, is the disposer of our affair, the trustworthy, that everything will be done to the specific measure and to justice and protection, and nothing will be missed. So in our trip for hajj, we need to put our trust in Allah. We put our trust to Allah to our family that we leave behind, that Allah will protect and care for them. Because first of all, we were just custodian. Allah is the one who gave those amana to us. And now you're traveling, you leave that amana to the one who gave you that, Allah himself, al Wakil. And then during your trip, you ask Allah to be your partner, in your, in your trip and to be the disposal of all your affairs during your trip and everything will be okay because Allah says whoever rely on him will be sufficient and whoever seeks sufficient from Allah will be independent from any, any need and Allah will be pleased so trusting and relying fully with Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala, it shows that we know who's Allah. And how about to put all our trust in the journey that we are going to complete the fifth pillar of Islam that he, Allah himself, commanded us to do. Allah wants us to put our trust and rely on him every day in our life until we go back to him. And there is uh, the Afkar, from Afkar Sabah Masa, which says, so, Hasbi Allahu la ilaha illahu alayhi tawakkaltu wa huwa rabbul arshil azim. Allah is sufficient for me. There is no God but he. I have placed my trust in him. He is the Lord of majestic throne. Subhanallah. Even if you have an issue in your trip, Allah will sort out. Allah will be sufficient for you. If you're ill, Allah will be, give you strength. If you have a problem, you know, in understanding, maybe language, Allah will sort out all your affairs. But what we need to do is to put all our trust by his attribute, Al-Wakil. Al-Wakil is sufficient for us. Subhanakallahumma wa bihamdik 
nashhadu an la ilaha illa anta nastaghfiruka wa natubu ilaika